Hello, and welcome to the Minutes Within the Mist, where we'll walk down the roads of Illinois to bring you stories about cryptids, ghosts, and other mysteries. Today, I'm going to tell you about the mysterious creature known as the Cahoma Monster. In May of 1972, around the Pekin and Peoria, Illinois area, an 18-year-old Randy Emmert and some friends reported a large, hairy creature near Coal Hollow Road. This monster was 8 to 10 feet tall and whitish in color. The boys said that it made a loud screeching sound. They suspected that it was living in a hole beneath an abandoned house. The creature left very unusual tracks having only three toes on each foot. Soon, there were other reports of the same monster and it became known as Cohomo. Short, for the Coal Hollow Road Monster. On May 25th, local police logged more than 200 calls about the monster, including one where the creature destroyed a fence. By July 1972, there had been so many sightings that a hundred volunteers were organized to search for Cahomo. In the end, Tazewell County Sheriff officers sent the volunteers home. This was after one of them accidentally shot himself in the leg with a 22 caliber pistol. The creature was seen again in July 27th of 1972 as East Peoria police reported that he was spotted by two reliable citizens swimming in the Illinois River. They got close enough to him to know that he smelled awful and looked like a cross between an ape and a caveman. After that, the mysterious creature was gone. I hope you enjoyed the stories of Cahomo, and will tell your friends about our cryptids, ghosts, and other mysteries. But until then, look under the houses and remain constantly curious.